Lydia Parker with the Climate Field View team, and today I want to talk about how you can use the scouting tools in the Climate Field View platform to help with your scouting efforts this season. Here you can see a vegetation map for a winter wheat field pulled open in the Climate Field View Black app. When looking at this vegetation map, I noticed an area of lower biomass surrounding the red pin. That seemed a little unusual for this area of the field, so I wanted to go out and ground truth this for myself to confirm there really was lower biomass in this area. I walked out to this area of the field and dropped a pin. I left some notes indicating that this was an area of lower biomass, and I took a photo to capture the plant stand. After saving this pin, I used the vegetation map to guide myself to an area of higher biomass. Here, I dropped a second pin to indicate this was an area of higher biomass, and again took an image to capture the plant stand. It was quick and easy for me to confirm that not only was there higher biomass in this area of the field, but there was also plants that were much bushier and much taller as well. If I wanted to share this information with my business partner, an, a retailer, or an agronomist, I can select the action icon next to the title and send this information off either as an email or a text. The recipient will get copies of all of the photos and notes that were saved, as well as the GPS location. Sharing this information helps keep everybody on my team in the loop. Now that I'm back at home, I'm going to create a saved field region around the entire area of lower biomass. And the reason I'm going to do that is it's going to capture the entire area rather than a single pinpoint. To create a saved field region, I'm going to select the circle icon in the bottom right hand corner of the screen and choose between either freeform or polygon. For freeform, I'm going to draw around the area with my finger and then select add a note to capture information the same way as I would for a pin. By creating a saved field region, I now have the ability to monitor this area throughout the season. When new field health images come available, I can monitor whether this area has grown or shrunk, or perhaps whether it's remedied itself. At the end of the season, I can also perform a field region report on this area once I have harvest data for this field. This will help me understand what the impact is of having lower biomass this early in the season. I hope you find these scouting tools useful for your scouting program this season. And as always, for more information, please visit www.climatefieldview.ca.